Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be going over, um, I've kind of gotten back into playing guitar and uh, a little bit and I've been playing the bass for a while now. Um, got two kids in the house now, not a ton of money, so I basically have no gear at home, so I don't have anything to play at home. I found some programs for the computer that you can use to play music, play your guitar and your bass through your computer and um, you can simulate popular amps and effects, a um, bunch of cool stuff um, and I think in the whole setup I've got about forty dollars maybe so I'm just kind of detailing this for other people who might want to try and do this setup Sorry for the shaky cam work. I'll try and be as steady as I can. My tripod is kind of gone missing. So, uh, yeah. Okay, anyways, I'll get started. Uh, kind of the base of my setup is... Uh, where is it? It's called Amplitude 3. You can download the actual program completely free. And that just gets you the basic setup right here. You get a one amp. I think it's modeled after a Fender Twin or something like that. And basically what you're looking at, that's an amplifier head. It's got all your, uh, your tone controls that just your basic amplifier would have. Um, and with this program you can purchase additional modules um, yeah, this may be supposed to be modeled after a Marshall amplifier uh, this one is modeled after this is one that I purchased for a couple dollars it's a model after the angle powerball basically it's a high-end um, high gain amplifier um, doo -doo -doo. so this is for guitar here's the basic bass amplifier you get when you buy the program I purchased the Ampeg SVT Classic um, so yeah there's uh, amplifiers and this also simulates your cabinets it's, you can change where your microphone placement is over here um, if you want it in the center of the cone placement affects your sound in different ways um, there's tons of customization there you got rack effects that you can add I don't really deal a whole, whole bunch in this but it's, this is a digital delay EQ that's all it's included in basic. I haven't bought any more of that stuff. Um, this is where your stomp boxes can go. Just a basic delay pedal. Overdrive pedal that comes with the program. Compressor. EQ pedal. Wah wah. Chorus. Flanger. You, you know all this stuff. Um, I think... I purchased something else. What did it? What was it? Uh, I guess not. It must have been a sample. But you can buy all sorts of like you can buy the um, models like the the Boss Metal Zone. All the popular distortion pedals are modeled, and so you can purchase them separately. Um. But yeah, this is basically what makes your guitar sound the way you want it to sound. Um. You have to buy a special interface, is what I'm going to call it. Um, I got that over here. Uh, LED. Uh, it's a Behringer guitar link. Basically, this is a USB. It plugs in there, down there. I don't know if you can see that, but it plugs in your USB port. Your guitar cable goes in one side, 
and then I've got it hooked. You can put your headphones in there, but I actually plug my guitar speakers into it. Um, I can show you how that works here in a little bit. And there's like a level for the output, your low and high gain, depending if you've got active pickups or a hotter pickup or something like that. It'll tell you when you're clipping, your signal is too hot. Um, so yeah, you need to buy this to get the sound to be really great. Um, there's a, uh, what is it called, a dr um, driver you need to install on your computer that it comes with. I mean that, I'm not exactly sure, you can't just plug it directly into the microphone and input your computer because the signal is, um, the the in, you have to have a special gain or you'll mess up your sound card on your computer and this interface through the driver conditions the signal I guess you could call it um, so it goes in your computer and the levels are decent and everything like that um, yeah I think that's pretty much it's kinda of takes some fiddling with um, over the past couple weeks I've been fiddling it with it to get everything working right and just it's a process you gotta go to if you want to do this it's not plug and play so you gotta figure it you gotta fiddle with it um, and maybe I can I can demonstrate a couple different sounds um, Amp. I guess I'll just kind of demo all the different sounds for you. Um, I'm not exactly sure how this is going to work because I don't have a tripod, but I'll try and get the best I can. I'll probably have to piece the clips together. Uh, Alright, that's it for this clip. Okay, I got my guitar plugged in here. Hopefully it's in tune good enough. Um, yeah, this is this is the basic amplifier that this amplitude program comes with. And you, you can hear Those are just cheap computer speakers. I mean, straight my guitar plugged straight into the interface, and then it is amplifier. Um, I'll show you some different sounds. I guess this is their Marshall model. Um, yeah, my guitar playing isn't that great, but this more of a sound demo. Remember, I'm just getting back into it, so don't rip me too hard. <laughs>
it's on is the speakers. And I've got turned up so you can't hear the strings on my guitar as much as you can the sound coming out. So there's that. Here's something a little heavier. some sounds from that. the bass is as exciting. Right, this is how I uh, I can practice along with some music. Um, this has kind of been um, kind of figured out as I go too. I use a program called Reaper. Uh, basically, it uses the amplitude three inside of itself. to uh, get your effects and everything, but if you want to, you can record um, what you're putting in the computer with all the effects and everything. Um, yeah, um, this is also, this was a free program. Um, you can uh, download this for free. I guess there's a demo of this. As you can see, this is inside Reaper. This is not pulling up amplitude. But I've got my amplitude right here. And I've got a separate track here that I... You can basically insert a track. And then you can load a uh, MP3 file into it.
practice session for our praise band. I can play this and then I can play along with my bass guitar. That's what I use to practice along with music. Yeah. Um, again, this was took me a couple weeks to figure out how to get all this to work together right. But uh, for forty dollars, it's a lot cheaper than going out and buying an amplifier and buying a stereo to play real loud while you got an amplifier real loud. I can plug in some headphones practice at night where the kids are sleeping. So, yeah, I mean, if you're seeing this and you got any questions, I mean, I can help you out the best I can, but I'm not a computer geek or anything like that. So, uh, yeah, I'll do my best. Uh, anyways, that's all for today. Uh, if you want to try this, have fun. <laughs> that's all I can say. Alright, see ya.